that do I be going to form or not? Has this point and it says six thinking hats. So he talks about six hats. And these are the six hats. The six colors are there. On a quick run, can you tell me what does black remind you of? Did you see the black color? What does black remind you of? Night, negativity, okay? Edward is one of black hats, giving a little bit of concept here, focuses on the possible difficulties, potential problems, and things that may not happen to you, given this idea or thought that you have. The second color there is white. What does white remind you? Peace, openness, right? A white hat is more about data, it's about neutrality, it's about information, it is about not having a clash or a conflict. Just pure flesh information which you can find available. The third one is yellow over there. What does yellow remind you of? Okay, yeah. Uh, some say also sunshine, people say positivity. While black is a logical negative hat, yellow is a logical positive hat that gives the benefits of any possible idea. Green, what does green remind you of? The color green. Greenery, vegetation, offshoots. The green hat is a creative thinking hat. This is a lateral thinking, innovation, creativity hat we all talk about. The blue hat, what does blue remind you of? Honesty. Honesty, uh, overseeing, being being there, the sky, the ocean, you know, neutrality, objectivity, being a facilitator. The blue hat is the hat that thinks about all the other hats. The president of the forum or the person sharing your meeting. Who thinks about all the other hats? The last one, what does red remind you of? Energy. 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 Uh, some people say blood. Okay? So red hat is all about intuitions, emotions, feelings, etc. 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 Now, Edward de Bono's six hats, this summary is available in the brochures available over there. It's an interesting concept to use these hats. You can go to that. Uh, a few articles in the details are given in the brochure over there. Now, these six hats, there is a specific way to use them. And when you use them, you can resolve all the concerns and all the problems that you do have. Now, how do you learn how to use these hats? So, these are the few points that people tell. This is how I learned how to use Edward de Bono's six thinking hats. Do I read a book? Do I browse the internet? Do I read journals? Do I read articles? Hear a speaker talk about it somewhere and try it out. Experiment it and see how it works for a period of time. But listen to those who try it out and see how it happens. The answer is not all of these. The answer is there is a one day interactive accredited Edward de Bono design specific international certification workshop. There are trainers who are certified, about six of us in the country who are freelance certified trainers, the only one me being in Hyderabad. Uh, organizations have internal certified trainers, but freelance people open to train anybody can about in this country. Uh, an extremely expensive certification program, but hugely valuable because one formula for all these issues, all these concerns, and it's not telling the same old wine in a new bottle. It is a new point. Now, what does this certification course give? That's how the manual looks. And you won't find the manual anywhere unless you actually a certified trainer. There is a participant's manual, an online course material. There's a software that helps you continue this forward later because the trainer will train you on a day, but later you need to take it forward yourself. And there is a certificate of participation that comes right from the Edward Bono group USA. 